I was looking through YouTube and realized that there was no good tutorials for socks by Dominic Fife. So I'm going to do the live version, not the studio version. Let's do it. to mute this E string with your thumb. The reason for that is you don't want it to sound like this. So you mute the E string, you just lightly put your thumb on top of it, don't push or put any pressure. When you come up, you try and flick it, the third string hard. And you move your fingers all one string closer to the first string, just like this. And now your thumb is going to mute the 6th string, so your E string and your A string at the same time. So you're just going to kind of wrap your thumb around and rest it on top. Now you're going to strum the 4th, 3rd, and 2nd string. And then same thing, you're going to use your pick and pull up on the 2nd string. You can hit like the 3rd the string while you're at it. The next shape is right here. So again, with uh, without muting and with hitting all the strings, it sounds like garbage. Put your thumb around, touch those two strings, uh, your fifth and sixth, and then your pointer or any other one of your fingers. You can use your pinky too, whatever. It's easiest for me to use my pointer. So if you guys want to use your pointer, it is touching the first string. So it is muted. So get that first string muted, and you also want to mute the fifth and sixth with your thumb. And it's the same idea. Strum down and pick at your second string. So you're coming down and picking up on that second string. So you should be hitting the fourth, third, second, and the um, fifth, sixth, and first string should all be muted. Now this part is relatively easy if you have this shape down with the muting, so and you're sliding down, same idea, your thumb is muting these two strings, your pointer is muting the first, and you're putting pressure on the second, third, and fourth. Right, so here. Now you just have to reset, come back to your first chord. Now instead of moving your fingers towards your first string, you're gonna move to this shape right there. And you're muting the E string with your thumb, and then you're only playing the fifth and fourth string. And then popping back up uh, on the fourth. And then, you're just moving both those fingers down one more closer to the first string with this shape. And now, same idea, muting the E string and the A string, so your fifth string and your sixth string. Just like that. So what that sounds like together. And then right back down to this shape that we originally played. So that all together sounds like this. All right, so now you're gonna play through that exact chord progression again.
once you get back here to this position, you're just gonna slide your fingers down one fret. Same deal, picking up on the second string. And then back up. Suspense, and then finish it off with this shape here. Muting your E and A still. And that is basically all you need to know for this song. That's that's it. That's all up to uh, the song structure now. Go listen. You know all the chords. You know everything to do with it. So figure it out. Subscribe.